Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading. Today I'm going to be showing you really easy and step by step how to make this Winter Princess Seed Beads earrings. I'm sure that with the detailed instructions you will be able to make them. If you're new here, consider subscribing with the bell for more tutorials like this. Please all of you like, share and comment. This helps me a lot and costs you nothing. If you want to see additional content from me, you could check the membership option in description and at the join button. I have two bidding courses. I will add more in future and in future you will get access to an area with bidding patterns, especially for the members. Without further ado, let's start with the list of the materials. Okay, my friends. And for this video, I'm using three colors of 11 ounce seed beads, blue, silver and white. I'm also using 6 o beads that are 12, 6 per earring. Earring findings, liver bags, you could use others of your choice. This is size D, Nymon Island thread, which is 0.3 millimeters of thickness. You could use similar thread with similar thickness. This is size 11 beading needle use similar size of needle and scissors. And now I'm going to take about an arm span of thread on my needle and I'll be back. Okay guys, and now I have six 6 o beads and I'm going to slide those down. I will stick my needle in my mat and here what I want to do is to make a knot And I'm making it by making a loop and going twice through the loop I've made and pulling and then I will make one more knot and pull again. Okay. Then I, I will go through some beads in this direction. I take one blue 11 -0, go in the next 6-0. I repeat this and do this guys until the end of this row. Okay, and I take three eleven o's. I go back through this blue and through the next 6 o and the next blue one. Then three silvers go back through the blue and through the next white and blue. Three silver beads and repeat this. Go through blue, white, blue. And do this until the end. Now, my friends, what I want to do next is go through this silver and exit through the silver that is sticking out the middle of the tree that you added. Now pick up five white beads and go in the next silver that is sticking out. Then five more. Five again, then five, and do this until the end. Okay, now in my next step, I'm going through two white beads, guys. I will skip this one that's in the center, the middle one, 
and I will go through the next two. If you wonder why I'm doing this, well, it is because I want to create a new thread pattern when I pull to have an angle here. Then I'll do this again, go through two, skip the middle one, and go through the next two and the silver and pop this one out. Then guys, go through the next two white beads, skip the one in the center and go through the next two whites and the silver and pop it out. Then again, two whites, skip the central one and go through two whites and the silver. Okay, two more white beads, skip the center and go through the next two whites and pull. Then again, two white, skip the center and go through the next beads. Okay guys, now I want to do an additional row. I'm going after this white bead. I take a blue bead and I go back through all of those beads. Then I go one more time through the white part. Then I go through this two whites bead, the silver and the next white. I take one blue bead and I go back through the white which is before the angle. Through the angle and then in this direction. Okay. By the way, you could do the two rows in one. I mean while creating the angle, adding the blue beads, but I just want to have more strength of my work and that is why I'm doing it in two rows, but it's up to you. Okay, now continue add blue beads here, here and here and I'll meet you. Okay, my friends, and I'm adding here my last blue bead from this row. And what I want to do is go in this direction and exit through the three white beads. And I take nine silver beads, guys. And as I'm exiting from this white, I go in the next white that is sticking out. Okay, and I take nine. I skip here and I go in this white. Again, I take nine and I go in the next white that is sticking out. And I will continue these guys three more times and I'll meet you here. Okay, guys, and here I need nine silver beads. And I'm adding them. And this is the last step from this row. Now I will start the next row. Go through this silver after the angle. Take three white beads. Go through the silver before the angle and through this white at the angle. Then go through all of the nine beads. And through the silver after that. I'm taking three white beads and I'm going through the silver before the angle and through the angle white bead. And now I will also go through all 
of the sil silver beads that are on my way all of nine of them and then through the white at the angle then again through the following silver and I'm adding three beads and go back And I will continue doing these guys three more times until the end and I'm sure you're gonna be able to make it by yourself. Okay my friends and I'm here at the last step of this row adding three white beads. Then I'm going through all of those because My goal is to exit through one of the white beads. I'm exiting out of the middle white bead that is sticking out the most. Okay, and I take 11 blue beads. Okay, 11. And I go in the following white. Take 11 again. Go in the next white that is sticking out, the middle one. Then 11. And go here. Now guys, I'm going to repeat this three times and meet you. Okay, my friends, and I'm here where I'm adding my last 11 beads from this row. And I pull. Then I go in the next blue bead. Okay, now take three white beads and go backwards like this through the blue through the white and through the following blue in my next step i'm going through five blue beads then i take three white beads i skip the center and i go through the next five go in the following blue three white beads go through the blue before the white inner angle and pull go through five again add three skip the one that's on your way and go through five and also through the white after that then again go in the next blue three white and go backwards just like this and i'll show you one more time and let you do this by yourself until the end go through five blue beads three white skip the center and go through all of those beads. Now guys, I will continue this until I finish this row and I'll be back. Okay guys, and here I am where I'm adding the last three beads from this row. What I wanna do next is go through two of those three white beads and I'm exiting out of the central one. And then I need six silver beads and I go in the next white. six silver go in the middle white six again and again six and i'm just connecting the middle white beads that are sticking out the most with six silver beads 
and it's really pleasant and really easy and continue this and I'll meet you at this point. Okay my friends and here I am at my last step where I'm adding my last six beads from this row and what I want to do is go through all of those silver beads then through the white and through the silver after that and I take two silver beads my earring finding and two silver beads and I go back like this through the silver before the white and through the silver after the white and I create something like a loop now I want to reinforce it several times then you could go around the edge and make additional thread pad to reinforce it if you want and after that you can find a place to make a knot let's say here make a loop and go twice through the loop you've made pull then go through some beads in this direction and cut your thread okay guys and now my winter princess earrings are ready so if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this it's a good idea to subscribe also click that bell button if you still haven't please like share and comment you could also become a member if you want to get additional content from me like two beading courses and in future beading patterns and more tutorials Check it out in description or at the join button. Thank you for staying here with me until the end. Now click on the playlist with Christmas tutorials that you see on your screens and continue watching.